in my opinion, obviously quarterback's the biggest need for this team. Uh, I've said it multiple times. Kyle Shannon does not trust Jimmy Garoppolo. That's why we need Jimmy Garoppolo out. Uh, if I'm looking at right now, I would figure out what you're going to do at the backup position. Are you going to get a rookie for your backup or are you going to get that veteran guy? Because if, I mean, if, in my opinion, if you're going to draft a quarterback in the first round to come in and try to lead this team to a Super Bowl in your rookie year, you need that bridge quarterback. Maybe it's by keeping Jimmy Garoppolo. Maybe it's by getting a guy like Alex Smith, trading for Darnold, trading for Bridgewater. I would prefer not to trade anymore, even though I I was all on the Darnold train. I'm off that now. Hopefully you guys saw my major <laughs> announcement video. Uh, but yeah, I definitely think you, it's, it's definitely interesting. Are you going to build around Garoppolo or are you going to get a rookie right now? As Nick said right there. So I definitely think you're going to see that within the next week. If the team's going to add more depth around quarterback and avoid the quarterback position, they're sticking with Jimmy Garoppolo. And maybe you'll get a guy like Kyle Trask, Kellen Mond, Jamie Newman, or something like that. Some guys that need a bit more development before they can be starters. Uh, or you could get a rookie now, maybe get it or trade for Deshaun Watson. Personally, I would go Fields, Lance, or Watson. One of those three guys. You have to wait for the Watson situation to play yeah. out. Uh, but Micah Parsons, that's an interesting one. Uh, I did not, I didn't, I didn't really think about that. Uh, but you're right. I definitely think we would have to trade a linebacker to get Deshaun yeah. Watson. They need defensive help. They lost Bernardrick McKinney. Uh, they're one of their best def defensive players on the team. I would think they would want Warner, who is in a contract year, and I think the Niners would be more willing to give him up because you have Drake Greenlaw, and then you bring in a guy like Micah Parsons who could really fill in that mo role really well the Fred Warner role I also think Jeremiah Owusu Koromoa out of Notre Dame could fill in that role as well that's a guy who seems a bit more reasonable at 12 uh because right now I don't think Micah Parsons is going to get past Denver I think Denver makes a lot of sense for him mm -hmm. at this point so we'll have to see what happens with that but that's a good point point. and as to the defensive line depth I definitely think I mean in the draft I think you're going to have to figure out the quarterback situation I don't know if Ojolari is going to be Great fit for the 49ers. I don't know if it's going to be reasonable for us to get him because you got the cornerback, you got quarterback still. Uh, I think you could look round four, round three, something around there. There's some guys round two as well that I've uh, that I've heard of really great, great things about. So that could be a great place to do that. Uh, but again, you lost, you did get Kerr, you did get uh, Ebukam, but you still lost Hyder, Blair, and Solomon Thomas. Maybe adding one more veteran to this defensive line and free agency would be a good idea. So I'm definitely with you on that. And the last thing I wanted to bring up, cornerback depth. You still don't have you, – you lost Witherspoon. You still don't know what's up with Sherman. I do think you need a, uh, a cornerback depth a little bit. You oh, only yeah. have – you have Barrett. You have Mosley, Williams, that it, uh, and Tim Harris, who may not even be on this roster. Yeah, and there uh, was uh, the, the guy that the team picked up from the Texans waivers, I want to say. I'm blanking on his name right now. But that was uh, I have no clue who you're talking uh, about. So – but yeah, I mean, he might not even make the roster as well. But um, I mean, and the one reason why I do want this cornerback depth, look at the cornerbacks available. I'm just going to name five that may fit this team really quickly. AJ Boye, Malcolm Butler, Steve Nelson, Brian Poole, Gary on Conley. Those are five that could fit this team. Maybe could start, maybe could back up Mosley. I don't really know. But there's so many cornerbacks out there. It's ridiculous. 